He's revealing to David what his ultimate goal in all this is. It's not about buildings. It's about a people who will continue to reproduce and allow a platform for Messiah to be birthed so that he can be the home for all of us. You know, we can only fit so many people in a building, but you can fit a whole planet in Christ. Everyone can fit in Christ. He goes to prepare a place for us. How big is that place? As big as whoever wants to go, there will be room for you. Now we're born of that reality. We're now temples of the Holy Spirit. That's why he could say, do you not know? You're temples of the Holy Spirit. You're the building that's being built together, living stones for a habitation, a place to live for God himself by the Spirit. That's who we are. We're not some backup, fall, fallback plan, safety net that God had. If everything else fails, I'll try to use a bunch of people with my spirit. Maybe that'll be good enough to keep it together and just keep the whole thing from exploding. It's not who we are, folks. If you think that about yourself, that's on you. It's not on God. He has desired to unify us and to build us into a force that the gates of hell themselves cannot stand against. That's what the word of God says about us. 